Hi, I'm Danielle from Interfit, and I'm here to tell you all about the newest addition to the Interfit Flash family, the Honey Badger. The Honey Badger is the perfect tool for any studio shoot, fitting power, speed, and versatility into an incredibly compact flash head. This is a great light for beginners as well as seasoned professionals. Just to give you a quick rundown on specs, the Honey Badger is a 320 watt second studio flash head. It's adjustable over a seven stop power range at increments of one tenth of a stop. It has a daylight balanced 60 watt proportional LED modeling lamp, a versatile modifier mount, and a frosted glass dome to protect the flash tube as well as spread the light evenly throughout your modifiers. The built-in radio receiver allows you full wireless control of the light from your camera using any of the Interfit TTL remotes or the new Interfit manual remote. So what's included? Every Honey Badger flash head comes with a protective shipping cap, a power cable, a sync cord, and a 24 inch pop-up softbox with inner and outer diffusers. Once you get this on the stand, you can adjust the angle of the flash head using the ratcheting tilt lock. The tension of the tilt lock allows you to make adjustments without the flash head slipping down. Remove the shipping cover by pulling the modifier release button and rotating counterclockwise. The versatile modifier mount allows you to attach any Bowen's S-Type mount modifiers or pop up soft boxes such as the one included. You can also mount an umbrella using the umbrella mount located just below the flash head. The Honey Badger has a simple to use digital interface on the back of the unit. Here you'll find all of your controls. You can test your flash function with the test button, which will illuminate red when the light is ready to fire. The beep button just above that allows you to turn on and off the recycle beep. Use the plus and minus buttons on the left to increase and decrease your flash power. The power output is displayed on the LCD screen above. The cell button allows you to turn on and off the slave cell. Turning it on activates the optical sensor, which allows you to trigger the Honey Badger with another flash unit. Perfect if you're incorporating this light into an existing setup. The model button controls the LED modeling lamp. Press this button once for proportional mode. In this mode, the brightness of the modeling lamp will adjust with the flash power. This is great for visualizing your lighting ratios. Press the button again to turn the lamp to full power. If you want to use the modeling lamp as your light source without the flash, press the flash button to turn off the flash function. This allows you to use just the LED and keep the remote on your camera in order to control the brightness of the modeling lamp while still triggering other flash units. As we mentioned earlier, the Honey Badger is compatible with any Interfit TTL remote or the new Interfit manual remote. When using a remote, make sure your remote and your flashes are on the same channel. Press the channel button to toggle between channels 1 through 15. When using multiple Honey Badgers, S1s, or S1As, it's helpful to organize your lights into groups. The Honey Badger can be assigned to any of eight available groups for individual control from your remote. Press the group button to toggle between groups A through H. Once you have the channels and groups set on your lights and your remote, you'll be able to control your flash power, modeling lamp, and beep functions of all of your lights. Thanks for watching this brief overview of the Honey Badger. For more information, visit our website for in-depth specs, images, video, and a downloadable PDF instruction manual. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.